Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to connect a controller to the Chromecast and install RetroArch with old console games. No additional cable or accessories are required. All you need is a computer, a Chromecast and access to the internet. The first step is to connect the controller. To do this, navigate right to settings. Then select remotes and accessories, pair remote or accessory. Now press the pairing button on your controller. In my case, an Xbox controller, the button is on the top side. Press pair and confirm the found controller with your Chromecast remote. You should now be able to control the menu with the controller. After the controller setup, look for the app RetroArch. To do this, navigate to Apps, select the search field, and enter the app name. With the free app RetroArch, various consoles can be emulated to play them directly on Chromecast. Download and open the app. At the first start you need to grant access to write external storage. Confirm with OK and allow, so that the app can download and install the content. After downloading, the app can be closed for now, as no games have been installed yet. Now a file manager is needed to be able to transfer the games from a computer to Chromecast over the network. Search for File Commander, install and launch the app. Since no pro features are required, navigate to the X button in the top with your remote or controller to close the overlay. Read and write permissions must be confirmed here as well. Navigate down to PC file transfer and turn on the network connection by pressing OK got it. And then toggle the switch from off to on. This IP address is now required on the computer. On the computer, open a browser and enter the IP address in the address field. Do not copy my address, but use the one displayed on your Chromecast. The games are called ROMs, and you can easily find and download them with a simple Google search. Enter the internal storage folder to display the file system of Chromecast. The RetroArch app has already created a folder here in which the games folder can be created. Click on New Folder and create a new folder, name it Games. Navigate to the Games folder and click on Upload Files, select Files. Select your downloaded games and scroll down to Upload. After copying the games, the browser can be closed. Back on the Chromecast, open the RetroArch app and select Import Content. Scan Directory, navigate to your folder. And confirm with Scan this directory. RetroArch will now import all compatible games. After the games are installed, we still need a core, an emulator for the selected console, in this case Super Nintendo. Look for the SNES 9X core in the list and install it. Now everything is set. Click on Super Nintendo in the left navigation bar and select a game. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. We have many more tech tutorials and interesting stuff. Okay goodbye, for now.